Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Caloris D. Carroll, The Scarecrow Walks at Midnight. I've started off with the IMK Peel Ease and here is The Scarecrow Walks at Midnight. Oh goodness. This polish is a dream. I mean just straight up dream. Beautiful formula. Amazing polish. I am sold. Love it. And I am so glad I got this one. It does have hollow in it and shimmer and beautifulness, but it's got a little something extra. I don't know what those are, if they're little flakies, but they are so pretty. I am going to go in with the second coat of this gorgeous orange polish here. And we're going to get it, I believe, to full opacity on two. I believe it's looking pretty good with two. So there it is. I'm going to top it with the Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. Get it to dry down. So I can do some stamping. I'm going to be double stamping today. It was what was I was in the mood for. I kept my free edge here real quick. This is Maniology MXM026. I've got my Conad Stamper out, and I've got my Beauty Big Bang Scraper and Braves Diva Game Over. Now my scraper got cleaned off with acetone. This is Hit the Bottle, Half and to Gold. Beautiful. Now this plate, I was a little concerned when I got it because I was like, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Um, it is a good plate for doing advanced stamping or reverse stamping, but you know, some of the images are a little small to be playing with, and I was really kind of on the fence of what I was even going to do with this plate. So I'm stamping down the first image, and as I do, I realize I've gotten it a little crooked, and um, it's not straight on the nail down the center like I wanted it. I'm going to clean that plate off with some acetone real quick. And then we're going to go in with the gold and stamp over the top of it. Um as I decide what I'm going to do with this Crooked Stampin'. I'm going to get that extra up with a piece of tape. I'm going to line it up and lay it over top of the black stamping there. There we have it. So I have decided since it's wonky and off to the side, I'm going to do the other one wonky and off to the side to mirror it on my other nail. And um, when you do things like this, just tell people you meant to do it that way. They'll never know. I meant to do that. You know, just sounds good, right? Practice it with me, y'all. I meant to do that. There we go. <clears throat> and clean that plate off again and go in with the gold stamping. Because, you know, most people don't do nail art the way we do nail art. So... You, you can just make up all kind of goodness going on with this stuff, you know? Most people don't even know what stamping is. So there we have our two wonky nails. <laughs> and I've decided to use this other little image on the other two nails. It's kind of like a triangle pattern with um, like a flower in the center of it. I decided, what the heck, let's use that thing. I don't know what it is, but I'm going to use it. And I'm going to go over into a corner of the nail and use that one. And just as with the other ones, I'm going to double stamp it in gold. And I did put that um, image that I used on the other two nails, I'll put that one on my thumb also. Just so you know what I did there. I'm going to turn that around so I can kind of see it and see how it is. I'm going to try to line this up and plop it on. So there we go. <clears throat> Excuse me. I do like doing the double stamping with the black and the gold. Because that way you can see a little bit of that black peeking out. But the gold's still very noticeable. I don't know. I'm just really loving that technique. Now I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to put this one on. I'm going to go in another corner. Blip, there we go. 
And let's get this with the gold. So there we go. Awesome sauce. <clears throat> So I will be topping it all off with this metric free top coat from Maniology. You'll get that to dry down. And then now with the Fast and Hard from Vibrant Vinyls. Now while I've got you on the hook here real quick, I want to let you all know that Sister Chic Lacquer is moving. Um, not on her website, but she is physically moving. So she's having an awesome sale. I'll list her store down below if you'd like to go check that out. You know I love her polishes. So I do have a swatch photo coming up here real soon. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this one. And I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.